Okay, this is Five Packs Week channel, and today I'm going to show you how to use Instant Demo, the capture software. I've recently just found, well, not found out, I knew about it, but I didn't give it a chance, and I found out it's a lot more better than Hypercam 2. And this is what it looks like. Um, some more of that. This will happen to you. It'll come up like this. I've only got the trial. Um, I'm not buying it. I'm a little cheap, yeah. But when you get into the demo, you can choose full screen, set to demo, or active windows, so it'll just go to any windows like you open up like this. Or well, imagine I can come here, like, and that will come up for you. That's not great. And then, something like that, you can change to sound recording, sound settings, recording options. Um, just you can like, combine with other things and all that. And really, you just click the start button to start, and you just hold, press control, um, alt and delete, alt and delete. And then it stops it, and you press press the pause uh, pause over break button, and it will pause the um video. Um, and what you can do is you can edit software. But I made an example in a video. I've named it demo. Is the video open like that? And if you've made a voiceover, it'll open like that. But you don't need to worry about the voiceover. You open up demo, and then it'll open up like a full screen view of what the video is, I'm going to make it a bit more smaller, like so, make it a bit more smaller, that's the um, windows, you might want to make it smaller, and this is what you get, and what you do is you have the scroll bar, to actually scroll across the whole video, like this, and what you can do is you can add text bubbles and all that, but I don't use the text bubbles, no, I just use them for stuff from Windows Movie Maker, and what you can do is like, I'm going to be zooming in and out of this video to show you stuff, and pretty much, yeah, I'm going to show you how to do it here, just an example. And what you have to do is if you scroll along, yeah, look, there's my email now and now. I'm going to click on something, a game file, like, um, I click on, what do I click on? I click on this. So if I want to go and click on it, I want to zoom in, maybe. So if I want to zoom in, I can do format, go zoom, and you can do um, region or track mouse. And I want to go track mouse. So it's going to be this, continue, and it's going to have this up, and then it's a bit more bigger for you guys to see. And what I do is then it will come up in the region. And what I could do is I can move it, I can reposition it around the mouse, and I can make it smaller or bigger. And, I'm, and the best thing is to have the mouse centered in the middle, because this is going to be following the mouse. And what you could do then is just drag this thing along, and you can see what it looks like, and that clicks there. And maybe I want to make this um, box a little smaller. So I can just Click on the line, maybe center it a bit more, maybe zoom in a bit more. See, and it will change and keep scrolling like the little bar along. See that there it goes. Clicks. Um, oh, um, and there, there it goes. Let's catch this up a little bit. And it goes here. Because it tries to make it, and also when you do it, sometimes the box may lag a bit, but it's because, or when you're making it, it may lag when like it's when the mouse is moving fast, because it's trying to keep it as smooth as possible and try to keep it like, really nice and simple. It makes a really nice feeling to it, really. It feels. Um, I, I click search on the Let's zoom in a bit more on this. Let's just um, zoom in a bit more, put more on this. So that I can zoom in and then go with this. It may lag a bit more, but it makes it more smoother. It does. It's, it's a really nice fit program, this is. Then let's do this. No, I want to make this more bigger. Um, let's do format zoom um, zoom to region okay. and then choose this and then let's do this and zoom is going to go hard it's hot like this and go this is like a, this is a um a, this is a demo Maybe I'll get any more, even more closer, personal with this thing. So, just like zoom in a bit more. A bit more bigger. And it makes you zoom in. And then, pretty much there you go. And what you can do is you click, um, once you've made it, this is pretty much all the zooming and filming you've done. All you have to do now is add whatever, like, write on it. You can add writing with this software. But if you have like a YouTube starting like I do, then you obviously want to um like as it in Windows Movie Maker. What you do is you click create, then you just name it, 
make sure you change it to an AVI file because then it'll make it into a video. If you make it into an add on flash, it what you want them to put it on YouTube, so it'll be add on flash is like a video for like internet, like on a website or anything. So use AVI and just click create demo, then it'll like then it'll go through this all graphically, then it will save you on your desktop. Um no then it'll save on your desktop as a video folder and then you can pretty much delete these two. They they, they should delete automatically but um there you go and that's how to use um press that there you go. And that's how to use um instant demo. Um hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.